everybody? What's going on, everybody? Let's see if everything went right, considering we came home, hooked up the computer, and everything is different from here and in the RV. So yes. give us a thumbs up if you can hear us. Can you hear us? How is everybody doing tonight? I am gonna. I know someone's gonna tell me right off the bat. Turn up the volume. So fix that let volume. Me turn up the volume. I just want to make sure you can hear us at all. And turn that up. That should be better. So how's everybody doing? I'm Joe. And I'm Rachel. And we're Two Crazy Ketos. And here on Two Crazy Ketos, we do different things like recipe videos and product reviews. And we talk about various keto topics. And every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us in different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com. And that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week. So make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon. And that way, every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Welcome to day eight of the 12 days of Keto Christmas These with Two Crazy Ketos. 12 days are going by so fast. They're going by so fast. Just like the holidays always do. I wonder who today's sponsor is. I can't imagine. Who could it be? It's Perfect Keto. It is Perfect Keto. And it's a perfect day for Perfect Keto. It is keto. Perfect day because they launched their new flavor collagen. It was the most requested flavor at peanut butter. Yeah. Uh, we are very sorry that we do not have one for a video for a taste test yet. Um, they were supposed to overnight it to us last week. Um, they actually sent us a thing saying it's overnighted. Would you consider if you like it doing a little promo spot for us? I said absolutely. If you know, you, like it. you know us though. You, if we don't like it, we're gonna tell you. If You're we like know. it, we're gonna tell you. And somehow it did not get overnighted, and we still don't have it. But I did say to them like, hey, we didn't get it, so I need a really good giveaway. And I think that they've come through. So. I'm actually going to throw something in here and, and like if I have to pay for it out of my own pocket, I will. Okay. So they told me to put together any bundle I want with a value of up to $200. Okay. So. That's not a bad giveaway. I'm going to go to 210 Okay. This is the Joe way. This is the Joe way. All right. What's okay. in this bundle, sir? Okay. So what's in the bundle? You're going to get your choice. Ready? You don't have to pick the same flavor as Joe. You, nope. You, you're going to get your choice. One box of keto cookies, any flavor you want. One box of keto bars, any flavor you want. One container of collagen, including the new flavors. Any which flavor is you cinnamon want. Cinnamon spice or the peanut butter. You could taste it before we do. And I saw that, you know, Serious Keto said it's like awesome. And okay. he's kind of picky on his perfect keto products. Yeah. But he said the peanut butter is awesome. Again, we should have hopefully tomorrow in the Love of Five Things review. One container of MCT powder. Any, any flavor, flavor you want. Any flavor bean, but not like Birdie Bots. A thing of base. The ketones. Maybe you have a workout coming up. Maybe you have a test or you're going up for like a raise at your job and you're about to get like a or review and you need to be like on top of it. Or you've just always wanted to try it but never wanted to pay for it. One, And so that comes out to be $190. Okay. But there was a product... That was missing in there. But wait, so I'm gonna, there's more. I'm going to tell him, like, you need to throw this in there. And if I have to pay for it out of my pocket, I will. Okay, and what is that? And that is your choice of one of the nut butters. They have the new nut butters in the jars. So you're going to get your choice, the winner, one winner, $210 value, one of every one of our favorite products that Perfect Keto sells. So the cookies, the bars... MCT powder, collagen, the base, which we don't even use that often. And once I just got this one because of the Black Friday sale. And one of the new nut butters. So how's that? I think he came through. I, I think this is awesome. And we are so sorry we don't have a review for you. But we do have a bundle for you. Yeah. So, so we have a giveaway. That's the consolation So here's how you have to enter, just like everything. You're going to go to the comment section, not the chat section of this video. You're going to yeah. leave a comment. And we are going to pick the winner tomorrow. And later on today, we're going to pick the winner for yesterday's giveaway. And it's pork and good, buddy. And it's pork and good. It's so pork so and gonna good. we're going to put this to the side. It's pork I and amazing. I am stuffed. Yeah. I'm stuffed. We um, did nothing but our, like, keto fear factor ugh, this week. Actually, it was the best fear factor we've had. I know, and that's not saying much. But then we kind of, like, broke our real fast with... A 20-ounce prime rib. Hello. We cashed in all those birthday 
coupons. And then also, they're running a great deal at Texas yeah, Roadhouse. Yeah, you like Texas Roadhouse? And, and we do this on ourselves. Hey, and if you want to call it, we're scamming the system. I'm scamming the system. Doesn't he look shifty? So you can go online. You can buy a $30 gift card. And then they give you a $5 coupon. So you can literally go online, buy a $30 gift card, and then they send you another $5 gift card for free. And now you can go to the store. You can go right to the restaurant within 10 minutes. Yep. And have $35 for $30. Or you can do, uh, spend $50 on gift cards. And I think you get 10. You get a, no, $55 on gift cards. 55 and you for get 10. a $10 gift card. Or if you spend $100, $100 in gift cards, then you can buy like two fifty dollars gift 20. cards. And you get a $20 gift certificate. You don't have to give those away. No. You can buy this, them and we, just use them yourself. This is our restaurant deal for the year. Yeah. We go and buy like four or five. We would usually do it for Buffalo Wild Wings as well, where we buy a couple of gift cards. They give you those 5 or $10 things. And then we use them. But it's like, hey, like, hey I'm giving myself a $100 gift for $80, $80. or $120 gift for $100. Yeah, so you've got like some gift for yourself, date night ahead of time. You're already going into the new year planning on And then when you some date decide nights. to go out to eat in a month or two, you're like, hey, it's not even costing me anything because you spent the money a month ago and you forgot about it. Exactly. You're more generous with yourself during like, the you know, December. Once January comes, you're like, we got to tighten up these reins. Yeah. It was funny though, because I asked the guy, have you ever had anybody buy a 40 ounce prime rib? And he's like, no, but we do have an elderly couple that comes in here all the time and they get 36 ounce ribeyes a piece so we were like can you slip them our phone number because we would like to eat with them yeah i want to go in and get a 40 ounce prime rib and just split it because i'm thinking it will be cheaper but more i want to see it. the waitress's face when why you say, would i share that with can you can i have a 40 ounce prime rib please i don't you think the, the that the waiter or waitress's face will be more surprised when i finish it so, how about that? Okay, so let's uh, let's see who's in here real quick. Hi, everybody. So Gail's here, pretty much. Uh, Gail's here. Alex is here. Line Girl is here. Um, we're gonna go over here because I know some things are missing. I know. I saw Gail said that she will be splitting her time between us and Autumn because yes. Autumn is doing her Wednesday live. We're stream. sorry, we're on here yep. at the same time she is. Because we don't want anybody to miss it, but it's it's just giveaway time. So Line Girls said, try and do meal plan for the holidays because I want to stay on track. Still having trouble getting used to working total carbs instead of net. You got it. Don't worry. You got this, girl. Uh, Heather said, I have a question for you. So a way to message you if I'm not sure to be rude. I had to ask in here in the chat. That's uh -huh. all for Gail. Um, Line Girl wants to know what are some of the total, your low total carb munchies, preferably savory? Uh, my meal consists mostly of some type of meat, a veggie, and then some small side. If you want a really good, very low carb, savory thing, Fat Snacks crackers. They're very yes. low carb for a savory little kind of munchy snack. Yeah. But uh, I'm a, ch I mean, we're mice. We love cheese. Mm. I like moon cheese. I like regular cheese. I really like treating ourselves with different new kinds of cheeses because right. then you're getting a bunch of different flavors and they feel very fancy pants. Yep. Uh, Tina Sierra said, I haven't caught uh, live in a long time. I'll be back Welcome. in Arizona. So the time difference helps. Hope you guys are doing well. Thank you. Uh, Defense Wiz is here. Patty Epps is here. Lori Good is here. Evening. Lisa is here. Shauna Welcome. is here. Uh, Krista is here. Hi, Krista. Uh, Heather is here. Hey, Lori. And let's see. Mommy hey, Heather. is here. Renee Hi, Mommy. is here. Um, let's Caboodle see. Brie. Caboodle's here. Kevin is, uh, Kevin is here. Linda is here. Yvonne. Uh, Sherry Long. Donna Hello. is here. Said hi to KK. Hope you're okay. Hi everyone from a snowy Pennsylvania. I Having a snowy. northeastern, expecting two feet of snow by morning. Wow. Ooh, that's awesome. Okay, so I was thinking dusting in my mind, and two feet of snow is like is a thing. Trucker Cat said, "Hey everyone, hey. I'm currently in Georgia, then back to Ohio in the morning. You need to make a detour down here. To yeah, us. praying for safe travels for you. Yes. Mary Long. Hello everybody." Uh, let's Scooter see. Geek. Avon is here. Denise is here. Christopher here is exhausted. I've been a couple. Oh. It's been a long couple of weeks. I'm ready for a Christmas. Break. Aren't you though? I'm so ready. Right family is here. Hey, right family. Yeah, her scale saying Jay, Joe, and Rachel. I'm also on Autumn's live. You are a multitasker. He said, now that the most hey. awesome person is here, the party can officially begin. Okay, now we begin. Steph now we said, start. I need those Perfect Keto bars after tasting the Hecka bars. Perfect Keto bars are the way to go. They're very different bars from, very, from Hecka bars. Very different. Hecka bars, some we like, some we don't. 
They're um, very hit or miss. They're very hit or miss for me. And it's not that the other ones are bad. It's just they're flavorless to me. Yeah. Or I'm expecting a really good flavor and then not getting it. And they're higher in total carbs because they're high in allulose. And I'm not, I'm willing to spend my carbs on the allulose for a really good treat if it's really good. Yeah. But if it's like, eh, I'll take one bite and be like, yeah, it's just not worth the carbs you for me. You know we like to get punched in the face. By the snacks we eat. Yep. If it doesn't punch us in the face, then it feels a little lackluster. Rachel Bartley's here said, I love Hi. Keto. The new cinnamon toast flavor is so good. I am very excited about peanut butter. You know, I'm a peanut butter aficionado. Mm -hmm. So, like, I was very sad that we didn't come home to it. Chugger Boy said, I do a glass of Perfect Keto chocolate collagen with almond milk every morning with my vitamins. Oh, yeah. I'm thinking that peanut butter in some almond milk, if it's as good as I'm hearing it is. I know. Like, that's going to be Rachel's new go-to. Yeah, well... <laughs> you know it well. You know me. Sylvia said, I can't hear you. Uh-oh. Everyone's saying I can hear you. Huh. Christopher said, any bundle you want for $200? Okay, give me $200 of chocolate peanut butter bars. Now, right. Now, I had to pick up the bundle, so I literally just did, like, one, one of, of each. each thing. So, yeah, that would have been cool. Like, give away a $200 gift card. Uh, Becky said, snow is pretty much stopped in my neck of the woods. South Central Pennsylvania, we may get a bit more snow. Just heard the snow plow go by. Aw. I remember when I was living in Virginia, you would be like crossing your fingers before it was time to go to work. You're like, snow plow, snow plow, snow plow. Come on, come on down my street. I got to get out of here. Snow plow. Yes. Yeah. Um, okay, now I can go back over now, here. Now, obviously, I'm paying homage to the worst Christmas movie of all times, and that is the Star Wars Christmas special. It was horrible. It was awful. It is basically unwatchable. There was also like a... Return to Frosty. It was like Frosty 3, also unwatchable. Like the first cartoon was really good and I love it. And then they just, they jumped the shark. Too much. Mommy said, I got my MCT bundle, but I'm okay to get some more. Right? I'm not, I'm never upset to get more, especially for free. Uh, we did get some mail. I thought Chris and Miriam were joining y'all tonight. I don't know where Chris and Miriam are tonight. They, they, maybe they're where with Autumn. Where is that new product? Yes. Where is it? Um... I thought I put it right there. Yeah, I see it. It's on the other side of Perfect Keto. These did come. If they you came. didn't see Chris and Miriam's uh, live stream last night, they have the electrolyte tablets. I chewed it. Which, Chris is like, what's wrong with you? I chewed it because I wanted to see how bad would it be if you chewed it. Something's wrong with you. And it is salty. And it, it is very salty. So this is them. Um, I think it's really cool, especially for traveling. I probably would prefer the drops. It's, I would probably say three a day. But they do stop us like at the airport when they see the droppers. Right. Because they're like, what That's is this? That's where I think they're going to be really good for. Make sure you're keeping this Afrin it sealed. nose spray? What is this? Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to test this. Okay, Chris said these things love humidity. Okay. So we're going to put this right here. Nothing is more humid than a South Florida home. And we're going to let that sit right there till tomorrow and see if it, see if it, if, powders if it turns up. to powder or how, how bad it gets for tomorrow. So... I'm going to put it right here on top of the salt thing. <laughs> Does and we're it turn to salt? we're going to put it over here. It is not, um, it, it was not. It's a, a good value though. I think it's like 22 bucks a bottle. It was not the horse pill I was anticipating. Because he no. was like, it's a horse pill. But man, I've That's seen a, Chris doesn't way, know. If, if this is a horse, horse pill, pill to Chris, he doesn't know what a horse pill you is. You never had to take like an antibiotic. My arthritis like, medication was twice this size. Yeah. I mean, that's like nothing. I've had, seriously, I've had pills where you had to take a running start. Uh, K Bear said, snowing to beat the band here in Virginia. Uh, Robin said, I love Perfect Keto. The collagen is so good. Chewbacca does rock, Beth. Carol said, what a beautiful bundle. Hey, Joe and Rachel. Hey. Sherry said, the base has helped me so much with my brain injury. It also helps me poop. Man, that just makes One of the things that the base that is really good Joe for, is all about that. I had a helps headache, a bad headache because it was, it was, I slept wrong. So it really hurt my muscle. I hurt my neck. So the headache, it extends up and causes me to have a headache. Probably didn't help that you banged your head either. You know, that's a size point. So we, we had some, I thought I had a tub of Relight, which I did, by the way, fine. We just tucked it into the back of the camper. Oh, we hit it good from ourselves. We hit it good from ourselves. Okay. And I was like, I need some electrolytes. I need some electrolytes. I've got it. We I think I'm low on it. it. So I just it. grabbed some base that have to be in the camper. And All it really about does the help because about that base. It's, it, what they do is they bind the ketones to electrolytes. So that's one of the reasons it kind of gives you a little bit of a pep. Um, Steph said, I got my Perfect Keto MCT and Collagen in the cart for tomorrow. 
Uh, Shauna said, I successfully did not snack today. Way to go. That is awesome. That I is I want to huge. just go live camping for like two weeks because I don't think about food when I'm camping. No, I we're having so much fun. The second I walk in the door, I'm like, what can I eat? What can I have? And but yeah. I, I don't think about it. We went until like yesterday we had one pork rind a piece. One pork yeah. rind. And we didn't eat anything on on Monday. And I walk in the door, I'm like, what can I eat? And Rachel's like, you're going to eat in two hours. I'm like, I know, but I want to eat now. That is the total proof that snacking and all, it's just, it's just it's all up in the mind. In the mind. Yep. It's just an occasion. Uh, Ann said, hello to Crazy Ketos. Amory from Oregon here. Hey. I'm so excited to have made it to your live stream. Thanks for being here. Linda said, I'm going to have to move to the U.S. so I can enter all the contests. I yes. am so sorry. I would really love to open it up to everybody else. And I know some people do, but here's the thing. My luck. Oh, yeah. Like, which is I'm none. going to have authorities knocking on my door. Yep. So, like, there is a, a law in Canada that you can't just have a giveaway. It has to be some type of a lottery because it's technically a lottery. And the law in Canada is you have to do something to enter. Like rock, paper, so, scissors? So, like, that's why a lot of times you'll see, like, giveaways in Canada. And it's like, answer this math question. Because oh, answering the math question... Um, basically kind of gets over that rule of you have to do something Isn't in order to, you can't just strange. give it away for free. Okay. You have to make it work where they have it. to do something, yeah, to work for it. Maybe they appreciate it more. I, I don't, I don't know. know. But yeah, my luck is that somebody would knock on our door. I mean, it's funny because, you know, when I got my drone, rest in peace, Autel, <laughs> um, I immediately went and got my part 107 license. Yeah. So if you want to fly a drone, you can fly it as a hobbyist or you can fly it, you know, for a business. Now, the FAA is kind of weird about their wording. So it says that you need a Part 107 license or certificate if you are flying that drone for the furtherance of a business. Okay. So if it appears on a monetized YouTube channel, that is considered the Boom. furtherance of a business. Yep. Also, though, if... You aren't monetizing your YouTube channel, but you own a business and you're doing it in the name of that business. That is the furtherance of a business. Yeah. If you post drone footage on your Facebook and it's just there, you thought it was cool, no problem. If a company picks that video and says, hey, I really like Great that job. footage on the campground, we're going to use it, still no problem. If you do it again and a company picks that footage up again, you're now furthering a business. So you're technically breaking the law. And only the FAA is in charge of the airspace. That's why you can legally fly over anybody's house you want and they can't do anything to you. Um, because only the FAA over owns that airspace. So we're rule followers. So he immediately went and got I went the pilot's and got license. It. And because my luck is, like they said, like there's YouTubers who post drone footage and the FAA is cracking down on people now. Yeah. One guy just got $182,000 in fines for breaking Dude, the FAA uh, rules, like flying too high, flying over people, all those kind of things. But they're going to start setting examples. And my luck is they're going to show up at my door. Right. And I really don't want a $1,500 really... fine for a two-second clip. I know. And so I Please just don't chose do to that. do that. But I know some people don't mind breaking the rules. I just don't want to. We're just not those, we're just not those guys. What just popped up here? Oh, email. Okay. <laughs> so Rachel said, you're porking good, Rachel and Joe. Too crazy. Thanks. Kiddos. You're porking good, Rach. Lori said, peanut butter collagen sounds tempting. I've never tried their collagen. Their collagen is really good. It's very, very good. And it's it's especially good. Well, I'm, I'll just drink it with water. Yep. I put the MCT powder into coffee. This is chocolate right now. But I really like the, the collagen on its own, which is water. Carly said, 100 people watching, only 40 people hit the likes. Hit the hit the button, gang. Those two are Thank worth it. Thank you. Thank you very much. Appreciate and, that. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I kind of forgot that like 5 to go was doing their Zoom tonight for their Elfster. Aww. And I was supposed to be on there. I'm like, no, no, no. I'm going to this family instead of that family. Heck yeah. So, um, let's see. Oh, Anne says that we can't eat in at restaurants yet. We can't eat in at restaurants wow. yet. Wow. Well, maybe they can, maybe you can do takeout. 
Actually, I know Florida is now starting to tidy up again. And you mean tighten down? Tighten down, tidy up, whatever you want to call it. And I Clean. saw a front page of the Sun Sentinel, like Governor DeSantis begging people go to restaurants. Otherwise, they're going to try to shut them down again. Yeah. But like if enough people go to them, but if people aren't going to restaurants and only ordering out, they're going to be like, you know what? We're going to shut down the restaurants again. My grandmother was a waitress for mm -hmm. many, many, many years. And I just, that's the only thing I worry about is... What do you do if that's your job or, you know, you have a restaurant? I just, I just worry about them. Parrothead Renee said, I made the gingerbread bones this morning. Maybe I didn't make it strong enough, but not a lot of gingerbread flavor. We haven't tried that flavor. I haven't I've tried found that, that with some of the bones too. Some of them are punch you in the face. Yep. Like the banana foster. some of them are like, yeah, it's very I, subtle. Yeah. Like it took a bath in gingerbread or something. I haven't tried that one though. I haven't tried that one, but I'm just saying like, it's that comparison. Defense Wiz says, I scam myself every time they run that gift card deal. They're always for me. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, Patty F said, I ordered my first pork and good today via your link. Thanks. I want to try the spicy. I love spicy. It's I love spicy. crunchy. I sure hope these are what I'm looking they for. They are spicy. Yeah. And again, if you got the stupid hot, they are spicy. We are not affiliates with them. We just really like them. They sent them to us and said, will you do a video or whatever? I'm like, sure, sure, no problem. So long as you give us a discount link for people who are watching. And so we don't make any money, but we do love their pork rinds. And that they don't have a bunch of garbage ingredients. And you will never see us promoting things that we personally don't eat or like or buy or buy. <laughs> uh sometimes we will buy it but i don't buy it because i can't trust myself with yeah. it. yeah but I, something i won't at least wi am willing to buy but we have plenty of pork and good because we love it oh we do uh mary said i might need to get those gift cards carly said just had hot bath and root beer keto chow for my omad after a 21 hour fast food stressful day hot bath time better than a bag it, of doritos that is totally better than a bag of doritos except for root beer there's nothing wrong with root beer. Root beer, though. There is nothing wrong with root beer. Ugh. Oh, that photo didn't come up. I'm very upset about that. Root beer. Oh, here it is. I'm going to put this up. What are you putting Don't up? Don't tap me. <laughs> I'm going to tap Rita, you. Rita, comment. I, I can't focus when you're not focused. Um, let's see. I was just going to say that. TMC Calmont said, hello, everyone. I love prime rib. Wish we, ha wish we had a Texas roadhouse here. So she said better than a bag of Doritos. I took this picture at dinner time and I said, who needs sugar when you can have that fat? That is some meat that candy. That is sugar to me. Look at that piece of fat on that piece of prime rib. Yeah. Like, look at that. It's prime rib. It's glistening sugar right there. Smothered in cheese and mushrooms and onions. Yes. Our breath is terrible it right now. It was delicious. It's reeking right now. But Squally it was good. said, so good it should be illegal. Exactly. He said, we use the same gift card track at Fogo de Chao. We have never been there. I've heard such good things. We've Me never too. been to Fogo de Chao. Renee says, Rachel, didn't you have more crazy Christmas hats or headbands last year? Last yes, year I did. Last year was the year of hats. Yeah, last year was the year of hats. This year is the year of pajamas. And I'm afraid of next year. What's next? What's next year going to look like? Shauna said, my daughter gave me $50 for Christmas, so I will be using that at the thrift store. Yep. I need clothes, and since weight is not coming off, I need clothes, so I cannot wait. I love that. Yes, I'm, I'm all about You're the thrift You're kind store. of missing that. That's Rachel's mom usually is like, here's money, and Rachel's like, oh... I'm taking this. Like, you're going to be so proud of me. You gave me 50 bucks. $50. I'm coming home with 50 items. Exactly. $50, $50 <laughs> items. I'm all about it. Uh, Lisa says, okay, guys, pray my son does not come call to pick me up from work till the live Ah, uh, Lisa, you're so cute. I love you. Matreya says, my phone won't let me do two YouTubes and a WebEx. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Aw. <laughs> Jessica says, good evening. Squality says, MCT powers uh, are just as good. Um, Darcy says, hello from Utah. Just finished my chili dog and ready for some laughs. Those PJs are so cute, Rachel. Thank we you. We are so far behind, but Sorry. you have mail over there. I do so have you mail. Gotta, you blow through this mail real quick because we want to show everything. Yes. It's so awesome. And we did mail out uh, the workbooks. We mailed out the workbooks. Thank you, Stephanie, again. All of the again. winners so far have been contacted, I believe. So this one is Merry Christmas from the North Pole. Enjoy. From Santa Claus. I don't know if Santa Claus would be sending this to us because it's reindeer. Is this the reindeer? It's literally canned reindeer. It's canned reindeer, and it's obviously the reindeer that w was not pulling his You're weight. Out of focus. Was not pulling his weight at Christmas time, so he wound up in our in our can here, and it's going to be 
in the Christmas edition of I don't know if that's going Keto to the Christmas Fear edition. Factor. We've oh got, no. No, we've got some other ones. There is nothing like a full circle holiday Christmas than making your kids eat a reindeer. <laughs> Let's do it. We've got the boys on board. Yeah, both of them are going to be doing the Fear Tenth Factor. 10th episode of Fear Factor will be the family edition. Seriously. All right. Uh, Steph said we decided today to do our pork loin for Christmas. James is going to have cauliflower cheese bad. and some kind of carnivore side. Next up is an ornament from Miss Jennifer. Thank you very much. It doesn't have um, a note to go with it, but it is the cutest ornament. Wait until you see this. Thank you, Jennifer. It's us in a camper. Is that the cutest that thing, thing awesome. ever? I love that thing. It says two crazy campers you guys 2020. Are awesome. You guys are so adorable. I love this so much. So April said I told my husband about the new peanut butter collagen MCT powder. I still want to mix the peanut butter and chocolate together for a oh, Reese's coffee. You know, maybe squirt some uh the of the perfect keto jelly peanut butter and jelly down there and then you can have your peanut butter and jelly trucker cat said drink. joe been loving your reviews on the florida campgrounds hubby and i will make a little trip for a week sometime in 2021 when my semi gets paid off in june yes okay let us so know. we found this place this weekend that we went to completely free yeah it was the Dupois campground Dupois, d-u-p-u-i-s i think yep and it's part of um the water south, management. Uh, south florida water management district and uh florida fish and wildlife i think it was uh -huh. and it was completely free and the thing is so there is no hookups so you don't have you know you have I'm to scary. go in there for you, me. You can't run your generator from 11 at night till 7 in the morning, which at this time of the year was not that bad. Rachel yeah. survived. I did. And I'm Rachel alive. loved it. They do have, you can't hook up your water, but they do have hose spigots if you run out of water. I didn't fill up my black tank. They have awesome clean restrooms with some of the cleanest showers I've seen, better than any state park we've been at. No. Mm -hmm. County Park. I've now, seen, we've had some amazing state parks. Okay, well, I, I think it's the second. The only state park I think that had a cleaner restroom was uh, Mayaka. Yeah, that was I think. Pretty. I mean, this these were some clean, clean restrooms, especially clean, for free. Clean. And a dump station on the way out. Yeah. And it was awesome. And the campgrounds were some of the biggest campsites that we have seen. Yeah. I mean, just everything about it was awesome, and it was free. It cost us 40 bucks in gas there and back. And six dollars in fuel to run our generator for three days. Can we? Can I share my last piece of mail? Yes, you can. But it doesn't say where it's from. It does, we don't know who sent this. I don't know who sent this, but this. So is So if awesome. you sent this, please let us know so we can say thank you. Yes, it says just a girl who loves chickens in Christmas. I love that thing. <laughs> I seriously like wanted to wear that so badly tonight. And I was like, you said that wear pajamas. pajamas, but like, how cute is that? That is definitely getting worn. Sean said, I'm trying that. to watch and finish one last project before my cortisone shots tomorrow, and I have to rest it for a while. Yes. Uh, Kev said, thanks for a wonderful giveaway with Perfect Keto. I placed my first order just after Thanksgiving, and I love the taste. Our weatherman on TV tell, told us that to break out the quilts and jackets if it drops into the high 60s. We need to do that. Yeah. We need a 60s. Hey, Keto Queening. Rachel said, I still use the electrolyte drops. Yeah. yeah. I think that these are just good for like traveling. Some people don't like the taste of the drops. So these really don't have a taste unless you're going to be like Rachel and actually chew on it for some reason. Heath is asking if I'm a Wookiee or an Ewok, but I'm a Wookiee. Kevin said, hey, Joe, have you watched Die Hard yet? I have not watched Die Hard yet. Well, We've been this watching year. Our, uh, not this year. Um, well, I've not been... this Christmas season. I actually watched it right before the Christmas season, but it, that doesn't count. No, right. We, we've watched some of our other Christmas We bought movies. the collection because they were having it on a really super cheap deal. Yeah, that was last year. Yeah. Um, Trucker Bat, Trucker Cat said, K-Bear, you should have come down to Georgia like I did. I'm currently in the middle of a Korean drama with him that I'm forcing him to watch. I like Korean dramas. Healer. It's very good. It's very good. Healer. Emily said, can you refill the pocket size of Keto Charge Drops with the refill bottles? If you can, I can't figure out how to refill the small pocket squeeze bottles using a big refill. Is there a small pocket one? Yes. Right there. Dun, 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 dun. So. I have to undo the sachet. What you do. Uh oh. Use your teeth. I feel like it's going to get teeth. very teeth. messy. Or we could just pull it. We could do that too. Okay. So what you do <laughs> is you unscrew this. Okay. 
and then this just kind of pops off like that. Okay? And then you just, there's like, it, you have electrolytes down but there. But use your like, pointer finger. So, <laughs> Please. Use your pointer so finger. So you, you just literally just kind of pry it off like that. And then yes. you can fill it back up. Just like that. Perfect. I like that. And then you can travel around with this. I usually, this is like, this is two, for, this, this is enough for two days for me. Yeah. So... Yeah, and what I what I like is a serving is a capful. Um, yeah, but that, to me it's not enough. I mean, it's I not enough, but that. but that's kind of like you can use that. Yeah. What was it? Oh, it was the front door. The front door. Okay, like, James said I... the Heck of Bar and this was keto crate wasn't it wasn't bad, just not as good as I expected. Because yep. the flavor that what they're were saying on the package is like such a great flavor that you can't wait to try it. Yep. Rachel said, if you can't pop the top off, squeeze the air out and suck up the electrolyte liquid. Yeah, oh, there you go. <laughs> he said, I love it when you have a tremendous number two and instantly feel 10 pounds lighter. Yes! <laughs> That's why I like going poop. Wow. That's why okay. I like having the run. Let's go ahead and move on. My, you, you you can say balls. Why can't I say I balls. like to have a good bowel movement? Okay. Mona said, I'd love to win the perfect keto for myself since my sister was kind enough to let me try the cinnamon toast flavor. That was nice. Uh, Denise said, I found a recipe for peppermint patties that doesn't use coconut oil. Will you make them for me and send them to Idaho? Wow, send us the recipe. Absolutely. I want to try that. Um, Who said I'm always here but shy? Scroll up. Laura Long. Hey, Laura. Hello. There's Don't no be shy. shy. We love family. We love you. Nicole said, got to go feed the family. Look forward to the replay. Well, thanks for being here, Nicole. Um, April goes keto. Hello. Tina said, how does it compare to Vital Collagen? Um, I like it better than Vital Collagen. I think it's much more flavorful. Yeah. I like um, the taste of it. I think it tastes good in coffee. Yeah. And I, I mean, like well, the even alone on better. water. Yeah. I really like the ingredients better. Pat said, oh my goodness, I need your Chewbacca pajamas. I just love these onesies. Rachel said, I just ate the dill pickle pork porking chicharrones. So good, but slightly too salty. And they're salty, but it's but in a good way, I think. Mm -hmm. it, and the salt and vinegar. One, if you're a salt and vinegar fan, the pork and good salt and vinegar will blow your face clean off. Yeah. I mean, it's sour. Trucker's, Trucker Cat said, it's better than Vital, but Vital is cheaper. I use Vital in my chow. Yeah, that's, it comes down to ingredients for me. You know, I know, I mean, and if there was another one that I think has better ingredients, I would use that one. Yeah, you know, it's we've just, tried different ones. I've tried a lot of different ones. We have one company that sends us stuff all the time and like, it's okay, but it's expensive and the ingredients aren't quite as good. So we're like, why so introduce like, another one? I'm, yeah, I'm just not like, and again, we won't promote something unless we're willing to personally purchase it and use it. And so, but they still keep sending it to us. Yeah. And, and I'm like, I'm not going to promote it because no. I think you're charging too much money and I'm not super happy with the ingredients. The best is when someone asked me to promote leggings. That were yes, 70 I saw that. $70 a pair of leggings. Yeah. And I'm like, I would never. You won't even wear Lula Roos. You know I get all my clothes from the thrift store, right? Yeah. Like, mm, no. <laughs> Sherry you, said, I no. wish people would stop coming to jail. It hasn't slowed them down. Oh, my gracious. Shauna said, the governor of Texas said he will not shut down Texas again, but did lower to the amount of people in restaurants again, I think. Yeah. yeah that's what the governor of like Florida is saying. He's like, I am not shutting down again, but I think they're going to start like slowing things down a little bit. So, um, <laughs> Lisa, oh, got to pick up my son. I'll be listening in the car. <laughs> Claire said, stupid hot flavor will burn your face off in, in a, a good, good way, way, but it will burn your face off. Oh, wait, Jennifer said, happy birthday, Elizabeth Wright. Oh, it's her birthday. Oh, yes, that's right. It's Elizabeth's birthday. I did see that. Let's sing okay. to her. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, birthday dear Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. you and many more. Uh, Joanne said, I appreciate all the product discounts you offer all the time. Thanks, Joanne. Uh, I did want to say that if you are interested in the Perfect Keto uh, peanut butter stuff, they are having a deal. It is... 15% off of you by two, 20% off of you by three, 25% off of you by four, and that is on collagen and MCT only, and it's any flavor. So you can get like two different flavors or three different flavors, and you can get that discount. But first, there see, is a link down below for but it. But first, see if you win for free. Yes. Uh, Renee said, now that deal is through Monday. 
Yeah. Uh, Renee said Jolly has an appointment with the arthro uh, specialist on Friday at 1600. Yes. Say prayers for a not so drastic, costly solution. No I'm amputation. No no amputation. Christopher had a root beer keto chop for lunch today with cream root cheese beer. and cream cheese. Make good choices. And a big couple cheeseburgers and some schoolyard <sighs> snacks and guacamole. Okay, those are, now we're doing better. You love root beer keto chop. I do, I do. Matreya said, I like things ridiculously hot and the pork and good have a little spice, so I think most people would say them to be very hot. The, yeah. You say they have a little, little spice? Spi I love hot. Are you and are you talking about like the hot ones or the, the stupid, stupid hot? hot? Ones. The stupid hot I felt like, are those are probably the hottest ones I've seen so far. I'm trying to think if I there's a that. hotter pork rind that we've had. I don't. I don't think we've had hotter than stupid hot. He said, fat kid pro tip, when you make a reservation at Fogo, I always put in the notes, please bring the beef ribs and lamb chops first. You can say that? That is awesome. That's pretty awesome. You know we need to go to Texas Day Brazil for my birthday still, because like I've got a coupon from them that they sent me for my birthday. I'm not going to argue with you at all about that. Claire said, I'm I need in. a new, new work wardrobe whenever we go back. I bought a dress just in case I had to go to the office a couple months ago, and it's already too Yay, big. That's a Claire. horrible problem to have. That no, that's a great problem to have. So I just said I've been thinking of trying the monk pack keto nut and seed bars and their granola bars. Has anyone tried them? Are they really okay for keto? Um, the ingredients I remember they're okay. were okay. I don't think that they're very tasty. Yeah. That's my opinion. They were very we mild. Had them, we had them in one of the bar in, in the yeah. box. They just weren't that tasty for me. Yeah. Like not bad ingredients, but just weren't flavorful. Shelly said Whole Foods has prime rib roast on special for prime members for $10.99 a pound. Isn't that reindeer covered in gravy? I believe it does have some tomato gravy yeah, that it's in. It's okay. But the chances of us tasting reindeer again are probably slim to none. So we're gonna we're moving forward. Yeah, and again, we usually do a bite or two and that's it. Uh, yeah, that prime we rib may just that is lap a good price prime rib roast. We may have to go. We get may one just of them. be like, Rudolph, you taste delicious. G -g 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 -g. Maybe. He said a few years ago I gave my niece and nephew snowman poop for Christmas. It was just marshmallows in a Ziploc bag. That oh is, my gosh, that is awesome. Well, we've gotten the ones. Have you gotten the little an animated animals that are like kind of hop along and they're pooping while they go? We've gotten that for Easter and Christmas pasts. Um, let's see. Wear pajama pants with your new t-shirt, Rachel. Oh, that counts. Does that count? That counts. No, you said it had to be a onesie. Well, that I, was your words, not mine. I don't care what you do. Okay, I'm going to wear pajama pants that shirt tomorrow. Kristen said, oh my world, I'm digging into this keto chop pumpkin sausage soup and I'm in love. That stuff is amazing. So I stinking good. I plan on making good. some for Christmas yes. dinner. Miriam, Miriam is here. Hey, here, girls. We just got done with our daughter's Christmas, Christmas. high school concert. Don't I knew you, there was something with the kids. Don't that was you miss away. those? I do. I actually, in my Facebook memories, it was like I saw a picture of me and Caleb sitting in the audience waiting for Anthony's um, Christmas concert. He was playing the trumpet back then. He was so tiny. He was like the littlest person. And then, you know, pictures of him. He did a good job. And, and he's so proud. And his Santa hat is almost bigger than his whole entire head. And it was just like... <gasps> Why do you get me every time Facebook memories? So we every are time. we are patrons or Patreon members. I don't know what you call people in Patreon. We we're have to, we're gonna be doing a live soon for our once these twelve days are over, we're gonna do another live for our Patreon members. We're very so patriotic. So if you're interested in being a Patreon member, there's a link down below to help support the channel. But we're Patreon members for a YouTuber for RVs called uh, Five to Go. Awesome family. They're actually spending the Christmas. They're they're full time or they live in a Class A motorhome, and they're all over Florida right now. Three kids. And uh, yeah, three kids in a motorhome, and Good they're luck. young. They're young kids too. Yeah. But they're awesome. I love the family. They're really cool. They they have a Discord, and I was chatting with um, Brian, one of the you know the the the, hus the father. And they went to Disney for a couple days to Fort Wilderness. And I'm like, I really want to go Is there. Everybody says right you now? have to go at least one time. But it's $125 a night to start to bring your RV there. So $125 to bring my own room with me to right. go to Disney. Yeah. And I'm like. That seems like Disney. Is it worth it? And everyone's like, you have to go. And I'm like, but see, we're not bringing kids. So yeah. like, is there enough to do as an adult in Fort Wilderness without going into the Are Disney Are we really park? adults though? And Let's he said everything honest. was open except for the restaurants. I'm like, I'm good with the not restaurants being open. Like, I'm fine with that. But he said everything else is open. And he's like, it is a lot of fun. He said, you got to rent the golf cart though. And he's like, you just need the golf cart to really have fun with it. 
and they said that they were they were resort hopping. Like kind of when you go to Vegas and want to see all the different hotels, you go to all of the different and resorts. And they allow that. And you can do that and, and see everything and you're allowed to do that. And but do you have to wear a mask anytime you're outside of your campsite. So right. even if you're just walking down the street with nobody, you have to wear a mask. Okay. But I was like, man, I miss like bringing the kids there. And I'm like, I'm thinking about, I'm looking up the prices. like just to go Disney trip. Just, just for the two of us to stay there overnight, maybe then driving over to Universal Remember Studios. Remember for our honeymoon, it was like a four, we got a four day per copper pass. And I think it was like 120. It was like 150 bucks a Something piece like for that. Four days. For four days. So for, per copper. If we want to go to Disney and get tickets to go to, into the resort. Yeah. You want to go, just the two of us. Okay. Two nights, three two days. Two nights. Two nights, three days, including tickets to get into Disney in the last week of January. Guess Take how much? Guess how much? $1,390. What is going on over there? And you can't park hop. So what, one you, day. You can go in, you get a three-day pass, you can go into one park. No. And you cannot go to another park the rest of the day. Now, anybody who knows Rachel and I, when we go to Disney. We're trying to we make time. Could, we could hit all four parks in one We're day. Zipping and through get that on place. every ride. But like, we had a system. $1,300. And I can't change parks? Like, yeah, no. I, we'll wait. I'll, I'll wait. Like, wait. I don't need to go to Disney that bad. Like, maybe gonna... I'll spend the $120 to stay in the resort. Yeah. And then just resort hop but i am not going in i'm not spending 200 dollars a day to go into a park and i can't even go to a different park i think a lot of places are going to have to recoup the losses from this year but i do miss doing all that stuff with the kids so yeah. we're making the kids go camping with us for five days <laughs> <laughs> all right kids let's do this patty upset when i babysat my son and read the die hard for to watch because he knows how much i love to watch it especially christmas time was not the sweetest thing was uh -huh. that not the sweetest that thing? is the sweetest thing um we forgot to mention, we did come home to this. Yes, if which is what I'm interested. drinking. I tried the, what, what are you drinking? What flavor is that? Pina Colada. Oh, you were supposed to wait for me. Sorry, I couldn't wait. It was so good. The watermelon lime is really good. Very good. Shake it. Shake it. Yeah, at first I was Shake like. Shake it real good. I was like, this is kind of like. Shake it up. You know, not not very flavorful. Like, I only taste a hint until I got to the bottom. Like, oh, I didn't mix it up enough. Yeah. So, so this, shake I have it not good. tried the pina colada. It is good. I mean, they're salty. Oh, that's that's good. But it's, it, it is salty. Like there's no it's, it's denying that there is a thousand milligrams of sodium, sodium in, this. in this. But it's good. It's got good flavor. Five hundred milligrams of potassium per serving. It's much saltier than a zip fizz, and it's a flat drink. And it's, it's not, not like as bubbly as yeah. a zip fizz. So if you are curious, so but there's no carbs in it. The ingredients in, I'm looking for... Do you want me to help? No. Can you see? Oh my gosh. I don't even think anybody can see that. I can so see So the it. ingredients in this are Redmond Real Sort, GMO free, citric acid, natural pineapple and coconut flavors, and stevia. So that's what's in this one. And it's five calories, zero grams of uh, carbs, zero grams of fat, zero grams of protein. We were doing better in the camper. How is that possible? And yeah, considering that we have so much better and it says here, it says we have an excellent connection. That's what's liar, really liar, weird. pants on fire. Why can't I get over to YouTube Studio? YouTube's acting funny. It really is. It like keeps kicking me over. It says we're live, but who knows? Did okay. we say balls too much? I don't even think we even said balls that much. I don't know. I don't think so. So there's your chat right there. Buffering started when talking about the relight. relight. Thank Joe, you. Joe, you owe me a burger. Yes, you absolutely do because there was no way that we were going to know that we were buffering. Yeah. If, I mean, unless Heather had like. Because just again, everything down there says zero drop frames. Yeah. So that is excellent very condition. Weird. Um, let it's, me just try to pull up the actual live studio. It's like you're droning on and on and you're just gone. Like the other person on the other end of the line is like, has hung up and you're continuing with the conversation, which I do all the time anyway. Yeah. Me and my mom do that with each other a lot. Okay. One second. We're almost there. And then we're going to go do. We want to do the drawing because in case something, in case goes, something goes wrong. Happens. Okay. Let's make sure. Got all of these buttons and levers and things to agree to. Okay, you ready? Are we back? 
We should be back. Yes, Rachel did not say balls too much. Why is it not? Let me pull up the chat. It's like, no, still no. Save. Well, did you? Did oh, because it's it's asking me, is this made for kids? No. It will not let me do anything until it's until No, it. this is not made for kids. It is definitely not made for kids. No. Okay, you're We right. are children, but it's not made for children. You should definitely click that button. Good now. We're back. Oh, okay, yeah. There we go. Are you ready? Balls let's, and poop. You're right. Let's go over and do... Let's do the Porking Good giveaway in case something else happens. Yep. We don't want to take a chance. Okay, ready? Yes. See how many people want to get the Porking Good Pork Rind Bundle. Here we go. Because it's pork rinds and it's the seasonings. Right? Yes. Yes. It's a really good We're gonna have, bundle. Now I'm going to have to pull everything down and edit it. 205 comments. And the winner of the Porking Good giveaway is... Pamela Atiabi, A-T-I-A-B-I. I've never tried any of the Porking Good products. Well, you're about to, Miss Pamela. I'm going to download both videos. Okay. I'm going to create one video. Oh, together. And then we're going to upload it as a new video. So you're going to comment on that. That's what we're going to do. So don't comment. I'm going to like, I'm going to make both of these videos like unlisted. So as soon as we're done, you're not going to be able to find them. And I'm going to upload one video like edited together without all of that buffering and nonsense and everything like that. And you're going to comment on that. So comment on the next video. That comes up. That comes up. That okay? is a live stream one. Yep. If you see me. And in we a, will put it in our Facebook group and everything. If you see me in a Chewbacca outfit, comment on that one. Yeah. If you want to talk, we can talk for a little while and I will go make that unlisted so that nobody can absolutely comment on yeah, that. Yeah, okay? absolutely. So you go, go for do it. that. Now you change it. I know, right? It's like... I'm sorry, but I want to make it fair for everybody. That's a big bundle. Yeah. Aha, uh -huh, found you. Just comment on everything. Yeah, well, you know, you can never go wrong that way. Just keep commenting. Say it on both, on both streams just in case. Put this video in front of the other one. Really confuse people. I think that what we should do is tape a third live stream and then like string those together. Let's just crochet an entire like series and we'll play like the shell game and you don't know which one you're supposed to comment on. Just really make it confusing. Merry Christmas, right? Love you too. <laughs> I'm confused. We comment on comments. Yes. So Joe is basically going to go and make the other one unlisted and you'll only have one, you'll have one video to comment on where I'm dressed like this. Just comment on that. <laughs> Comment and thumbs up. Thank you. I'm so confused. I'm confused too. We'll make sure that we also make a mention of it in the Facebook family group as well. Stephanie's here. Hi. Um, Christopher said, if you had three videos, you could braid them together. Yes, let's do that. Let's make a friendship bracelet out of videos. Trucker Cat's laughing. I'll have to research how to make pork rind tortillas. Yes, I want some of those. Still thumbs up this one too, folks. Thanks, Renee. So, okay. So, okay, yeah, make this clear. So It's downloading. So there's only two people who commented on that video. So it's okay. you can't even find the original live stream. It's gone. So it's gone. So Carol and Sylvia, make sure you're going to go and you're, you'll need to re-comment on the, the re-upload. And Chris is telling me check the restream download because it may be not having the buffering in it. And we can just kind of Thanks splice the two you together. My PJs, Miriam. Yeah, and we'll go from there. But I want to make sure this is a big bundle. I want to make sure everybody has a good chance to win. So yeah, so we're just I will re-upload everything in probably like an hour or so, and that's the video. It's gonna be like perfect keto. They'll say like perfect video, perfect keto giveaway replay or something like that, and that's the one you're gonna comment on. Yeah. Okay. Steph said I only make tortillas with pork rinds since almond and coconut flowers don't like me. I, we haven't had a pork rind tortilla yet. We did. I feel like we did yeah, one. Yeah, we did. Did we? We mm -hmm. did one. That, In my tortilla press. Okay. That the strong sisters. No, no, no. the recipe. That no, one? That, it was my thing. I just like, it wasn't enough that I wanted to make one because it doesn't work without a tortilla press. And I didn't want to put up a recipe telling everybody, you have to go buy a tortilla press to make this recipe. Aw, that was nice. But it was good. It was really good. It was very good. And we were using the corn... OOO drops. To make it like Yeah, the cornbread O drops to make it like cornbread flavor. Rachel, is your outfit a particular character, says Gail. Yes, it's actually Chewbacca from Star Wars. 
oh, you put your glasses on. I was like, uh, like you were going to get serious about Star Wars or something. I thought you were going to say something really serious. No, no. I'll tell you what I'm very serious about. Getting to watch the new Vince Vaughn movie. I am very excited about it. What is that? It's, oh, the new Vince Vaughn movie. The new Vince Vaughn I movie. I want to watch it. I'm not paying twenty dollars really to good. rent a movie. Yes. twenty dollars to rent a movie. If we went to the movie theater, though, which I don't even think is a thing anymore, um, we would be paying way more than that because movies were very expensive to go to the movie theater. Chris said Joe announced he's getting a neck tattoo. I would never get a neck tattoo. You know, if you did, it would break the the live stream for sure. It would definitely, yeah. No. How about a facial I've talked tattoo? about getting a sleeve, but yeah, like Miriam said, I'm going to use the money to go to Utah instead. I we got... We definitely want to go to Utah. I got... I want to go during the winter time. Very I know, close that's weird. one time to getting like permanent tattooed makeup. And then I met a lady who had a nightmare situation, infections and all kinds of stuff. And I was like, yeah, I'm not doing that. I'm... You know what? I'm just not doing that. Chris, <laughs> like, I'm Chris not says that's right. I bet we can convince Redmond to split the cost to fly in the out. You don't need to fly us out. We have some vouchers to fly out there. Yeah. We just have to find the time to fly out there because I don't want to come out there for two days. I want to go out there for like a week. Maybe they only want you to come and out there for two I days. I want to go out for like, I want to go out there in the winter. I, if I'm going to fly, I want to go see the snow. See, we have to time this right when we know they're going to have a snowstorm. Hey, weirdo. Uh, you're timing it like, oh, it looks ominous outside. Well, Let's get a really plane. Do you really want to go to the desert in the middle of the summer? I'll go anytime. I want to go during the winter. Uh, Miriam said, if you came in the winter, you could go skiing. <laughs> Let's get racial skiing. That'll be really funny. Heather said, my eyeliner is tattooed. Have done it twice. Second time was a nightmare. So you you had a bad situation with this. This woman had gotten like the lips done too. And her her lips got like really jacked up from it. I was afraid. Because um, I, I mean, there's some days where you, you have to put on makeup and you're like, I just don't want to do this anymore. Yeah. Like I just, but I need to paint this barn. I want to get electrolysis it doesn't look so, so I never great. have to shave again. Oh, That'd that's be awesome. That's cute. Yeah. Uh, the fence was said, which movie is Vince Vaughn in? I thought I saw the uh, it, his most recent one. Yeah, it's one where he is basically a serial killer who's about to kill a high school girl. I can't remember the name of it now. It, but it, they've been showing it on iTunes, and they swap places. And now he's like a teenager trapped inside of, I mean, Vince Vaughn's body. And the killer now is trapped inside of this cute little high school girl. That's like so sweet, but like chasing people with chainsaws. And it just looks really funny. Heather said Iowa has snow. Oh, we're buffering. Oh. Meanwhile, it says excellent condition. It does. It says excellent condition. Okay, we're going to get off.